This is a particularly happy occasion for me. It gives me great pleasure to be able to thank the University of Carleton for the honorary degree of law which they are conferring on me. There are several reasons why I feel very proud and happy to accept this degree. First of all, I'm an honorary citizen of Canada and I take great pride in that. And secondly, I have been aware of the great work that the students of the university have done to help the movement for democracy in Burma. And last but not least, I'm very glad this is an honorary degree in law and I feel that I am accepting it on behalf of the Legal Aid Committee of the National League for Democracy. Let me explain a little bit about this Legal Aid Committee. I think I can safely claim that this is the first of its kind that has been founded in Burma. We founded it back in 1995 to help those who have been accused of political crimes, although I do not think that one should look upon it as a crime. I say political crimes because we think that it is for political reasons that these people have been accused and then sent to prison. But the authorities claim that it is because they have committed crimes. So we felt the need to protect those of us who have been accused of crimes simply because we have followed the dictates of our conscience. During these more than 16 years, we have done much to stand up for the rights of our political prisoners. It is true that we have seldom won a case. In fact, I think we have won only two cases of the hundreds, perhaps thousands, that we have tried to protect. But that does not discourage us in any way. Our colleagues who have been accused are satisfied that we have stood up for them. They are satisfied that they are people working for rule of law in this country. And even if they, like the Legal Aid Committee itself, know very well that the decisions as to how to punish them have already been made before they're taken to court. They still appreciate the work of our Legal Aid Committee. We stand for the rule of law because we believe that unless there is rule of law, there can be no security in any country, in any society. And unless there is real security, there can be no real freedom. Freedom without, without security is incomplete, just as security that takes away all freedom is incomplete. Because we believe that freedom and security must go together, we are very, very firm in our commitment to the rule of law. So I accept this honorary degree in all due hum humility because I do not really know anything much about the law. I was not a student for law. What I learned, I learned through working with our Le Legal Aid Committee. And what I learned over the last years have convinced me that law is one of the greatest achievements of human beings, but just laws. And to be able to apply these just laws is a sign that we have truly become civilized beings. So may I thank all of you for looking upon me as a civilized being, which is, I think, what it means when you confer on me an honorary degree in law. I hope that we will be able to work together in future, that our work will bring us closer together, that our cooperation will increase, not from year to year, but from day to day, and that Carleton University, its students, the students in the rest of Canada and the people of Canada will all join us in our efforts to bring about a society in Burma that is made secure by the rule of law and by the guarantee of basic human and democratic rights. Thank you very much.